Okay. Alex, well, what did you think of uh, Nate tonight? It seemed like a little bit of a more of a struggle for him than usual. Um, well, all depends how you see it. You know, I, I, I do believe Stassi was the one that hit, hit the ball hard twice with a homer and the double to right center. Fletcher did a good job going the other way, but besides that, it was you know, that the last inning was what a single, a double at. 85 mile per hour, or, you know, 65 mile per hour blue. Uh, Iglesias puts the ball in play. We get the bases loaded with two outs. You know, the hit by pitch put him in a bad spot. And then Fletcher with two strikes, he puts the ball in play. We always talk about that, right? We like doing it. And that's what they did today. They did the same thing to him uh, early in the season. Uh, go the other way, put the ball in play. He he struck out nine with, with all that. The stuff was really good. Seems like he found his crew uh, in the middle of the game. Just in the first inning, it happened fast, you know. Uh, three pitches, they score one with that second, and then Stassi with a big, big swing on on a three-two count. Alex, you had quite a few at bats with runners in scoring position, just not able to kind of put the beginning together. Yeah, and Lagar is, you know, he changed the game with that play. Uh, that that ball, that's a home run, you know. He's four-three yards, and uh, but you know, he's a good center fielder. Uh, yeah, we I think we. We grinded at bats. We just couldn't, weren't able to 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 cash in, like you said. But uh, you know that play by Lagarde was it changed the game right there. We get the lead, and obviously it's a different ball game. Alex, so Tony threw a, a 97 mile an hour fastball and a 67 mile an hour curveball. I mean, kind of everything in between. What did you think about uh, you know watching him for seven innings? Yeah, I mean, uh, he saw Garrett doing it for us. Richards throwing that 68 and 95. So uh, you know, good pitchers copy others. You know what? Uh, he is a different pitcher than in 18, we, we thought. I think in 18, when we came here, it was early, of course, and, and the stuff was electric. Today, you know, yeah, he threw hard and all that, but he, he pitched. He pitched today, you know, fastballs up, the split down, slow breaking balls. Uh, you know, you see him, he goes seven, but he, he wasn't as smooth at, at, at it. It looked, you know, the feedback, you know, the, the fastball up made a difference. Uh, you saw it with Alex, right? After a 2 0 count, he threw three up in the zone. He struck him out. He struck out JD on fastballs too. Uh, the fastball was a, you know, we had life at the end. But, uh, you know, overall, you, you see him and he, he knows what he's doing out there. Obviously, you know, just watching and, and knowing what, you know, the, the at bats and you got to run the bases and you got to, it's amazing what he's doing, unreal, you know, because to, to do it at this level, uh, I, I can't even, you know, we talk about the preparation and what he has to go through to, to post every six days or whatever he do and then to play, be the DH and do the things that he does. It, it's amazing, you know, it, it's, it, it's great. It's great what he's doing. Alex, how's Santana? Yeah, he, um, he, he, it's his left quad. Uh, you saw him limping towards the end. Hopefully, you know, he slowed down enough that, you know, he wasn't that bad. Obviously, he's getting treatment. He'll come back tomorrow and see how he feels. With him, obviously, you know, speed is part of his game, you know, and then moving in the outfield and all that stuff. So we got to be very careful. Uh, he has past history with that. Uh, we just, you know, we'll see where, where he's at tomorrow and we'll, we'll decide what we do. Given that, that uh, Marwin's also hobbled, do you need to get a body out overnight? Well, um, that's what we're talking about. Uh, there's not too many bodies around here. Uh, and I don't think we're going we're gonna to make it, they're going to make it on time if we have to bring somebody from outside. Um, you know, Kevin is probably available. If that's the case, maybe. Uh, he, he run the bases today. He's been hitting tomorrow. He was going to have a, a, like a heavy load of workout, uh, a workout behind the plate, throwing the bases and all that. If that goes well. And we have to make a move. Most likely it's going to be Kevin, you know, to, to have a body, obviously with Connor that we can move around and, and Christian too. So we feel comfortable if that's, a, if that's the case. So you, do you guys not have any taxi squad players left that save us go home? No, no, no. We don't, we don't have it here. Nope. Anything else? We're good. Have a good night. See you guys tomorrow.